What's up guys, Psycho Serpent here, and um, this first video was a bit uh, unhelpful, so what, you wanna, what you're going to want to do is go into properties of your Steam and um, change your regular Steam from uh, that and just add on space and then the minus and then console and then press apply and then when it says the administrative, press continue. Then press OK and it'll close. Open Steam. Um, you might need to restart your computer for this. You might need to just like close Steam and do something for like 15 minutes and it'll come back up. Uh, this is my Alta account. And this is the console right here. And um, right now I'm going to show, I'm going to try to show you. And, uh, okay, no, this is not what I wanted to show you. Okay, um, Okay, you're going to need to use CSGO Lounge for this. And here's mine. So what you're going to want to do is, um, I'll just use this guy for, like, a uh, reference. So just do, like, a funny offer for the fake one. Um, so at, at, at first I, uh, well, at, at, at first I forgot to log into my main account, so. Okay, so. Just log into this. Sign into the new one. And just go back a whole bunch. And then back. Oh, hmm, back twice. Yeah, there we go. Uh, Steam offer. Okay, now what you're gonna see is I'm just gonna offer him a case uh, for his knife. I mean, I think that's a wonderful trade. That's probably one of the best trades I've ever seen on CSGO trading history ever. This this is the the profit he's getting, and as you'll see, it says uh, I've logged in from a new device in order to. Check the items in your inventory. You're unable to trade from this device for seven days. And we're going to bypass that. Uh, just exit that. And what you're going to want to do is take that trade link from that trade menu that you're in. And just highlight the whole entire thing and copy it. Once you've copied it and you ha already have the console in your Steam, type in open space and then just control V where that uh, link is and then press enter and it'll open it in this little weird file it is sort of harder to see but you can just go into the full screen and yeah that's basically all you really have to do and every single time you uh, every single time you want to trade for like the seven days that you're banned you're gonna have to do this over and over again so I mean it is a pain but it works and if you really need to trade then this is this is what you can do and then I just make the offer simple as that and thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time